While I was doing the research on Consuela's backstory, I pretty much found out her whole life story. So she was, the spirit that was haunting her was a Mexican-American woman named Consuela, of course. And then she was like crazy obsessed with this guy, like crazy obsessed with this guy. And so he didn't want like anything to do with her. So he pretty much looked at her and he was like, yeah, I don't really like you. So I'm going to go date a bunch of bimbos. Okay. Like it's just, it's fine. It's fine that you're in love with me, but I'm not going to date you. And so then he went and he like dated a bunch of girls and then Consuela was like, wow, this really sucks. And so then he got drunk one night and he was like, okay, well, now I'm really drunk and actually, secretly, I'm really in love with you, which, I mean, that's just me guessing. But, so he went up to her door and he was like, hey girl, let's get out of here. So then they went to like some cave that's around here. And they like totally did the thing that you do when you're in relationships. They danced? No. They did the waltz? Tango? No, you don't go to a cave to do a waltz or a tango. Yeah, that's what I'm asking. Did they make s'mores? No. Did they order a pizza? Pizza man can't come Did up Did they here. roast enchiladas? Give me something here. They did what the birds and the bees do in the spring. Oh my god, will you just say it? They. They pollinated the flowers? Yeah, they pollinated in a way. Sure, if you want to call it that, I guess. Pollination. That's not possible. They're not actually bees, guys. What are you thinking? Bad sex. Mm. What the heck is that? Is that a s'more flavor? Yes. It Dude, is what grade did you make it to? What? I'm in 8th grade right now, what are you talking about? I go to school every day! Do you sleep there or something? Do you have health problems? Whatever. Um, no, so, right. the house so this whole me. trip did not. I thought we were. The whole point of us coming out here was to let Squirt here go burn off some sugar that you gave her earlier, which I told you not to. But no, we're out here all about that fucking doll again. I got rid of that doll for a reason. But now her ghost is haunting us. No, so, nothing's haunted us. Everything else is haunting us. Not it's not Consuela. You heard the phone. So I mean, it's definitely Consuela because you burn, you like completely trash the body, and it wasn't now a body. It was a doll. You know what I mean? Okay. That was disgusting. It was plastic. It was a doll. I mean, there wasn't blood and gore. Anyways, it was gross. They had extreme s'mores in the cave, and then they, um, they never talked again because he didn't want anything to do with her when he was sober. Probably because she and burnt so, the s'mores. All right, let's go with that one. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, so she burnt the s'mores, and he didn't want anything to do with her. And so uh, he pretty much ignored her for like the next nine months or a couple more. That's and a little much over the yeah, s'mores. So I mean, I know burnt s'mores are disgusting, like especially like when you set them on fire, like gross. But all right, stop talking about s'mores. It's about to get real. Okay, the beat is about to drop. Anyways, she really? found out the next day that she was pregnant with his child, and um. He didn't talk to her for like nine months and then she gave birth to the baby and her parents and her family disowned her and kicked her out of the house because she had sex out of wedlock. She made s'mores and, out of wedlock. And she got a crazy meth addiction, lost all her teeth and lived the rest of her life in the Salvation Army. Um, okay. Sure, except that she didn't do meth and she didn't lose her teeth and she wasn't in the Salvation yeah. Army. So she I lived- I had that back then. In the park up yeah. there, because, yeah, she she pretty much slept in the park up there with her baby every single night until one day, the guy that totally dumped her showed up at the park with his new beautiful girlfriend, of which he probably had about 60, 
So he showed up there and she was like, oh my gosh, I love you, you're so amazing. And he was like, I don't want anything to do with you. Stay away from me. Mm. And so she got really sad and she went kind of crazy. And then she ended up pretty much um, cutting her face off and dying in, uh, in this park. Really? As she rocked her baby. Okay, what happened to the baby? Well, I guess some BMXers were like doing BMX stuff over here and they totally like botched a trick on her body and found it 18 years ago. Oh yeah, I remember hearing about that. Motherfucker goes up for like a 360 tail whip, totally cases the jump, bam, falls on a dead body. It was all over fuck paper. News, all that shit. It's probably the most excitement this shithole town's had in a long time. What the heck is a paper? think it's Consuela's baby, do you, that the whole legend's about? Well, it didn't cross my mind, but now yes. that you mention it, probably. That's probably exactly what this is about. So what the fuck does this have to do with a doll anyway? Well, it was the only possession she brought from home after her parents kicked her out. Shut up. Nah. -uh. Yes, home. Nah. -uh. Anyways. You just fucking made that up. What, do you not it's like the dolls ugliest fucking doll in the world. Or whatever. Well, I mean, she... So, what... Alright, uh, alright. Okay. Don't make fun of kids' dolls. Who's her yeah. favorite doll? Anyways, we're here, and I figured that since you made that ghost camera thing, we can test it out. Uh, this thing is not field tested. That's not a really good idea. Well, we can field test it now. <laughs> no, because you'll go. You know, like you'll get shot and you'll die. Then why the fuck am I holding this thing? This is an untested camera obscura. You, you could die or break it, and um. I don't want it broken. I don't know which one I would rather have. Evidently, you would rather have me die than have it unbroken. All right, just give it. Um, just give it I would have said that. It's fine. Okay, it's fine. It can't. It's not gonna do anything. Sure. Oh! Why don't you test this? I don't know. It shocked me. I just come to think of it, I just forgot, you know? Just had no idea. Alright, guys, just here. You take this camera, and you two can go look anywhere else. And I'm gonna go look on the bridge, this thing, and we're gonna see if we can find her ghost here. We wanna find her ghost here because. If she's here, then that means she's not at our house haunting us. Let's go find her. Where? Anywhere. Ow. Man, her fucking just... 
barking out orders like always. You do this, you do that, blah, 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 blah. I don't even know what the fuck I'm supposed to be looking for. It's unreal. I don't even get it, man. I mean, what the fuck's with these Wilmansons and digging up dead shit? <clears throat> All the fucking time. I'm just... Fuck. No shit. This place looks familiar as fuck. No shit. I fucking remember that. Man. That's where me and my bros went. That was the night that got me all fucking tied up into this shit. And then rest in peace, homies. You know, I know I'm supposed to be looking for ghosts, but I mean, flowers are so much prettier. I quite like flowers, although there aren't many varieties here. It's mostly just white. I'm not even sure if this is a flower. Could someone tell me if it is? Oh, there's a, there's one yellow one. Look at it. I don't even know what that is. I love flowers. I wonder if you can get in trouble for picking flowers. I don't think so. I kind of, I really hope she didn't break my camera. That's like my best friend. Honestly, well, you know, I should be probably more worried about her dying, but I, and I feel kind of bad that I kind of think I'm not. But, I don't, I'm conflicted. But just cameras are so nice and they don't say they they don't yell at you when you try to take too many enchiladas. All right guys, I need your cameras cuz were I got to check if you guys got the ghost. Can't we do it like inside where it's warm? Where's Paco? Wasn't Paco supposed to be filming with you guys? I thought he was with you. Okay guys, so we're finally gonna figure out if we caught her on tape at the park or if she's haunting us here. Ouch! You, you've got to be here somewhere. I mean, you remember me, right? I'm um, in Constance. You lived in my house for a while. You tried to kill me. You mostly tried to kill Jesse. Okay, that's cold. It's really cold right here. And I feel like someone is behind me. Yeah, that doesn't feel good. I'm just Okay, that feels a lot better. Um, all right, so there was definitely something there. Okay, so she was actually at the park, which means that she's not haunting us here. Although, she might come back here because she's kind of in love with Jesse, it seems, so. But yeah. We totally have to go back, but we shouldn't do it at night at all. We have to do it in the daytime because, I mean, spirits are totally going to fuck with us if we go at night. Yeah, look at you getting smart. Mm -hmm. you're, a lot, you're, you're a lot better at this investigating thing than I thought. You're actually a lot better than the ones before, come to think of it. 
Yeah, they really weren't too good at it. Well, so. me. Well, I mean, you're awesome too. We couldn't have caught Mary and we couldn't have even seen this ghost if it weren't for you and your devices, so. What are you hiding under your blanket? Bruce? You got your hand stuck in the Pringles again, didn't you? Really? Yeah, Just let go of the chip. I'm not holding on to the chip. You have to be holding on to the chip, otherwise your hand would slide right out. Let go of the chip. I'm holding on to my Oh my shot. god. Bruce! Oh, you get. Do I need to get soap? No, I'll ruin the chips. All she needs to do is let go of the chip. It doesn't work. Alright, we're gonna have to amputate. No, we're not. Yeah, well, you can't go around with a fucking Pringles can on your hand. Uh, I can you now. You can go around without a hand, that's normal, but that, that is not normal, so we have to cut it off. Is he being for real? Is he serious? Oh, yeah. All right, so I'm just gonna keep this here so that if Consuela ends up coming over here tonight, then we'll see her. And then if anything's like out of range of that, you can use that to get her. Fine. Ugh. Well, I'm going to bed, I'm tired. The whole fucking park thing wore me out. Are you gonna sit there the whole time? Yeah. Why? Well, I don't want. I want to go upstairs and sleep alone. The story was scary. All right. Get up. You can sleep in my bed. It's fine. I don't want to move, I'm going to wee my pants. You guys don't argue and I want to go to bed. I'm not that scared anyway. Take can hand and go. It wasn't even scary. It wasn't even scary. It was dumb. What's scary is that Pringles can on your hand. Peace and quiet. All right, guys, so you remember those BMX series that we were talking about over at the park? Well, turns out they had like one of their loser friends there filming their sweet tricks. So there should be a video somewhere on the internet. And if I can't find anything on the internet, there's the deep web. So that's what I'm gonna do for like the next however many hours it takes me. I mean, the deep web's a scary place, but come on. What have we not seen at this point? Oh my god, that's so gross. That's disgusting, that's really disgusting. Stop it, Paco. Quit. Quit, man, you dick. Get off! God. <laughs> the 
fuck, man. Every time. Leave me alone. It keeps replaying. It won't stop. It was a ghost. I don't know. A ghost pushed you out of bed. What? You're awake though now, so we can go watch movies or something, right? We wanted to do that earlier. Okay. So what's wrong with your generation? Did you print it off the internet? I, I don't even no. Just stop. Just stop. So Why let's. Why wouldn't what you are, read it on the computer? Okay, I'm tired of standing here holding this fucking bazooka. Let us. Uh, what, what do we do? What, what's the crowd and wait? Just got an answer for everything. 